Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with episode 33 of Skyrim. When we left off, we were actually on our way up to meet the Greybeards again, to give Angir the horn of Jorgen Windcaller. So that's what we're gonna do. <laughs> because Lord knows the Blades don't trust us, why would she, why should we risk our necks for that right now? We need to do the ones that we actually trust. And trust us back, for that matter. It's the way you live your life, kids. Fuck those who don't trust you. Ah, that you've not to the be taken literally, metaphorically. Well done. You have now passed all the trials. Yes, I have. Come with me. It is time for us to recognize you formally as Dragonborn. Fair enough. You are ready. We will do that. And the final word of unrelenting force. Da. Which means push. Push. Da. Fus ro da. Okay. Now if I had frickin' connect, I could be screaming that into that and be making my guy do it. But no. I don't have connect. Because I'm a normal person. Anyway. Now, go to the middle here. Directly in the middle, because... Fuck y'all. I can't. Now I'll be reading this upside down. I don't care. Da. I'm sure it is. Alrighty. Okay. And now I'll look to you. My buddy. Your training, yes, I have. We would speak to you. Stand between us and prepare yourself. Now the control is gonna vibrate a lot. I'm gonna hold it to the mic so you can hear how much. It only does it in bursts. The first one's short, but... <laughs> there it goes again. Alright. There we go. You have tasted the voice of the Greybeards and passed through unscathed. More or less. Is open. Woo! Alright. Good. And now we'll head out and do the Blades thing. Because, you know... It's nice to do things for people. Even if they don't fucking trust you. How do you make them trust you? By beating their ass at what they consider they're the best at. We'll head to Morrow's Eye Pond. And go there. And we'll just simply go... East. I continually screw up my directions. I've said this in a stream, I've said it on recordings, I screw up the cardinal directions. <laughs> never eat soggy waffles, but the problem is I never remember where the fucking E and the W go. Fault. I'm just fucking... Wait. Leave me alone. <laughs> well, in the comments, you don't have to leave me alone. I'd rather have some freaking feedback tell me how to remember that. Anyway, well, this is the well, spot we have to head to. What in hell's bells is going on there? Is that a bunch of freaking... Are you kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? Normally, there's like a wolf or something on this path, and I can understand that. But now, spiders... <laughs> spiders. Why does it always have to be spiders? That's a reference. You don't get it. We can't be friends. 
Okay, we can probably be friends, but... You know. <laughs> God damn. These ones are strong motherfuckers. And down you go. Ah, the music died. That was weird. Well, it's not weird. It's not unusual. It's happened a million times, but... And I also found something out. Uh, after I picked these flowers. That, uh, this place actually was Jazz Bay's. Which is, you know, not something you usually find. And the bushes look something like this. There, see? I actually only just learned it recently. <laughs> it was within my Stray Cat playthrough. But I did not even know that there was Jazz Bay's that would grow here. And there's probably some of you who didn't either. So I figured I'd show it. Just pick up a bunch of them on my way to freaking... Pick those. Blue ones are always in short supply. Yeah. Hey, Foxy! Just, you know, easily findable. Pick them up on the path. Alright, that's enough of that for now. Whoa, it got foggy. Holy shit. And we'll head this way. Whee! Oh, I made it. Cool. <laughs> that's Corundum. I could always use that. It's good for locks when you're building your houses, and that's always good to have. You know, because locks, they're nice, keep you private. There we go. That's the stuff. Hostess. Sponsor. Totally not, though. I really should stop, but I like Hostess. So, you know. I normally, people expect me to like the Twinkies because I say, oh, I like Hostess. No, I don't really like the Twinkies that much. Their particular favorite. It's more the cupcakes and, uh, what else? Those apple and cherry pies they make? Yeah, those are more my favorites. But, I mean, don't, I'm not saying go out and get me some. I'm just saying I like them. <laughs> It's like, how would you be able to get me them anyway? You don't even have my address. But, ooh. Heading to Kynes Grove now. Head into here. Holy crap, I just ran through trees. Uh, anyone going to tell me what's going on? Or is that going to... Oh, you're here. Okay. No, you don't want to go up there. A dragon. It's attacking. Um, I'm aware... Where is this dragon? It flew over the town and landed on the old dragon burial mound. I don't know what it's doing up there, but I'm not waiting around to find out. Fair enough. Hurry. Where the be too late. hell you come from? Alright. Jesus. Let me just pick these flowers. Dragon's tongue are good flowers. I swear the snow screws up with my recordings. So, we're gonna start from here, even though we were not that far back. Okay. I don't know what it is. Lord the snow God. just completely that big fucks up the entire recording, and I don't understand why. Uh, Firebolt. We'll be using that as a ranged attack. Uh, parents are playing with the dog, apparently. I can hear them screaming from across the room. Across the house. More like. Okay. Foxy, you better fucking run. You're gonna die. <laughs> Buddy, run. Dude, listen to me. Run. Oh, Jesus Christ. No, you're not gonna get this motherfucker. Oh, Jesus. Okay, I got flung across the fucking thing. Okay, I'm okay, though. That's good, I'm okay. I'll take those mountain flowers that I just got next to. Fucking speak basic! I can't understand a damn thing you're saying. I didn't 
take it. They thrust it onto me. I understood, Kree. You're going to die. Oh, fuck. Get back here, you little shit. Okay. Got some damage in. Woo! Had to deal with that real quickly. Fuck. Speaking of damage, I'm pretty damaged. <laughs> I'm gonna fix that. Okay. I'm gonna use one of these just to get them out of my inventory. Add minor healings. Fuck. Okay. This is good. This is good. I can get myself into a rhythm for taking down dragons. I'm um, taking Magicka. One of those. Two of those. Okay. This will work. Where is this guy going? Okay. Double firebolt. That was good. I have to concentrate to make sure I'm not missing these not many times. Okay. Down you go. Yeah, it's done. Yeah, I killed it. So now I take his soul. So you really are. Watch me devour his soul. <laughs> yep, I'm Dragonborn. Believe me now. Damn, her eyes are wide. It's true, isn't it? You really are Dragonborn. Fuck yeah. A little Go bit. Ahead. Whatever you want to know, nothing held back. Who are you, and what do you want with me? I'm one of the last members of the Blades. A very long time ago, the Blades were dragon slayers, mm -hmm. and we served the Dragonborn, the greatest dragon slayer. For the last two hundred years since the last Dragonborn Emperor, the Blades have been searching for a purpose. Now that dragons are coming back, our purpose is clear again. We need to stop them. I, I was looking down because I noticed her sword doesn't have a sheath when... Normally, for the player models, it gives it a sheath. Anyway, off track. What do you know about the dragons coming back? Not a damn thing. I was just as surprised as you to find that big black dragon here. I've seen that dragon before, the one that got away. Really? Where? It was the one that attacked Helgen when all Frick escaped from the Imperials. Interesting. Same dragon. Damn yeah, very thorny. We're wandering around in the dark here. We need to figure out who's behind it all. Yeah, <laughs> you think I was going to say something else, didn't you? I was contemplating it. <laughs> What's our next move? The first thing we need to do is figure out who's behind the dragons. The Thalmor are our best lead. If they aren't involved, they'll know who is. Fair enough. What makes you think the Thalmar are bringing them back? Nothing solid, yet. But my gut tells me it can't be anybody else. The Empire what about the dragon we just saw flying and brought this one to life? Over. Then a dragon attacks, Ulfric escapes, and the war is back on. And now the dragons are attacking everywhere, indiscriminately. Skyrim is weakened. The Empire is weakened. Who else gains from that but the Thalmor? I can't argue with your reasoning. It seems sound. I mean, you know, we're excluding the fact that that fucking dragon brought him up, but okay, we'll go with your thoughts. So we need to find out what the Thalmor know about the dragons. Any ideas? If we could get into the Thalmor Embassy, it's the center of their operations in Skyrim. We're doing Probably some cloak and dagger shit, aren't we? Up tighter than a miser's purse. They could teach me a few things about paranoia. Okay. So how do we get into the Thalmor Embassy? Mm, I'm not sure yet. I have a few Great. ideas, but I'll need some time to pull things together. Meet me back in Riverwood. If I'm not back when you get there, wait for me. I shouldn't be long. Keep an eye on the sky. This is only going to get worse. Okay. Damn, she looks good in that armor, though. 
Anyway, what we will be doing instead is, I mean, we could be dealing with the Glenmore Coven. That would be good to do. I mean, for the majority of the world, not just this for the companions, but uh, that's for a quest about uh, Ethereum. It's a dwarven metal thing. But uh, I think what I'm going to do is just go back to my house and just make additions to it. You know, build up, you know, my house. Because I'm going to be here for a while, apparently. For a very long time. Might as well make myself comfortable. You know, that sort of thing. Okay, I'm getting a little too high-pitched now. I'm going to go down back to what my normal voice is. Okay. Yeah, I shouldn't be doing that. <laughs> I'm just a little weird. Alright. See, what else do we need to add? What we were going to add was... Oh, we're going to remove some of these workbenches. For right now, anyway. Uh, don't need the bedroom's workbench, because it'll be furnished on its own. What I will be doing is taking some of these first. Um... There's that one, that one, that one, that one, and this. Uh, what I'll be doing is actually planting one of these. I don't the plant. It is planted. And I think what I will do, maybe, is plant tundra cotton because lavender I can come by in droves tundra cotton not so much we'll call that good just plant those and let them rebuild things and storage room is being made with doors okay that's what we were doing I had to take a second to remember I uh, need three of those for locks um, some nails. Need all of them, really. Uh, take most of these. Yeah, I'm already carrying too much. Yada, 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 yada. I'm aware. Um, take some of these, too, because I'm sure I'll need some freaking, you know, something for iron ingots and whatnot that I'll need to make. Uh... We'll just take all of this, uh, make a grundam ingot. Oh, I could be making silver ones too. Might as well. And we'll walk my happy ass all the way to here. Uh, let's see. Need three locks. Three of these, three of these, and make one of these for good measure. And hopefully that's all we're going to need. Make the doors, the foundation, floor, wall supports, roof. Walls need clay, which I have right here. Uh, needed three, if I remember right. that and there we go we have just fully built a house look at that isn't that gorgeous all right now we just need to furnish it which will cost a lot fortunately I do have some gold but we will be doing that in the next episode 
Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. I'd be post I'll be posting them daily. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And you know, share so I we can bring more people into this community. And comment so I have some feedback from you guys. And I will see y'all in the next episode. This has been the one, the only Stray Cat playing games for you.